Welcome to Rick's Corner. I want to discuss eggs today. So many people have a misconception about eggs. All I hear is I'm having egg whites and oatmeal, I'm having egg whites. Restaurants have egg whites on the menu. Do you want yolks of that? Do you want just the whites? This was a trend that came about many years ago that the yolk was not good for you. You have to have the whites. There's too much uh, cholesterol in the yolk. It'll give you high cholesterol, it'll give you heart attacks, and you'll die. Well, quite the contrary, that's not true. Back in the 70s and the golden era, we all ate eggs, whole eggs. There was a farm by my house. Actually, it wasn't a farm. It was a, it was a dairy, uh, kind of like a drop-off place where people would pick up their eggs and their milk and they'd move on. But they would have uh, jumbo eggs, a dozen, for 39 cents. So I'd always go buy six, seven, eight, nine dozen eggs and keep them in the house. Now, all the guys back then ate whole eggs. Ed Giuliani, I remember him, every night at dinner he had six to eight eggs. Eggs in lunch, eggs in the morning. Yeah, you get sick of eating eggs, but they're the perfect source of food and a perfect source of protein. I think there's seven grams an egg, something like that, of protein. Well, I've been eating whole eggs for a long time, as if you look on my Facebook, everybody commented, they are too. So I asked my cardiologist about it. What's the story about the fat in the eggs? I know that it's good for you. I know that it has less than that burns fat, and there's no harm done. He says, this is absolutely true. You will not get high cholesterol from eating eggs. The fat you use is energy. The lecithin that is in the egg and other nutrients are good for you, and they burn body fat. So you get your source of protein. It's the whole egg. It's, it's all a whole food, and it's definitely good for you. So don't be alarmed when people ask you if you're eating eggs and you say you're eating a whole egg, or don't, don't go by what they tell you, because the egg white was a huge trend. It's been going on for a long time. People still do it, but they're missing part of the food. They're, they're not getting the whole food out of it. It's wasting the yolk. I have a... Well, it's my own way of making my eggs in the morning. I, <laughs> my girlfriend calls it the 170s because I do it a minute and 70 seconds, which is actually two minutes and 10. But um, I take the eggs. I'm using two today just for the sake of using some eggs, but I'll sometimes do three to four. And then I will add the liquid eggs. Now, these are whole eggs liquid. It's not the egg whites, as you can see here. Then I hit them with a brawn blender. It's a stand-up blender, which is a great blender for mixing your protein drinks, for mixing anything. It works really well. So I blend it up till it's all pretty much blended. And then I will put it in the microwave for 170, as you can see here. When I pull it out, it looks like a saucer, like a, a flying saucer had landed. But it's basically, it looks like a souffle. It flares up and it's nice and easy to cut. I cut it in little squares with a knife and then I eat it and I have my oatmeal with it, maybe a piece of toast. And then I wash the same bowl, this is what guys do. And then you use the same bowl the next morning to mix your eggs the same way. It's a very easy way of mixing eggs without having to use a pan to wash and all the cleanup. Plus, you're not using oils and butters and frying it, which you can do. It doesn't really matter. This just works really well. So I wanted to show you, if you want to try doing your eggs like this, experiment with your time. My microwave does a minute 70. It makes it just right. And that's for three eggs and some added egg. Um, and it works real well. So you might want to try it. That's my tip to you. Uh, try your eggs that way. It's very easy to do. They taste pretty good. And it's easy to clean up. So don't be afraid when you eat eggs. You will definitely grow from them. They will put muscle on you if you eat a half a dozen to maybe even 10 a day. It's not going to hurt you. They're a good snack. You can hard boil them, keep them in the refrigerator, put a slight bit of mayonnaise, make a little egg salad out of it, add a little bit of tuna with the egg, then you got a really good protein snack. And it's all real food. It's not a supplement. Okay, guys, thanks for watching Rick's Corner, and I will see you all next time. I have some guests coming on this week. Um, I have a dancer coming on. He's not a bodybuilder, so don't make fun of him, but he's a dancer, and he trains at Gold's Gym because he likes to stay in shape, and he, he um, tours with Lady Gaga. I thought that was very interesting, and I like to talk to people like that because they have a whole different perspective on how they work out and what they do, and I think that's what makes the world go around, different views from different people. It's not all about getting 22-inch arms. It's about looking good and staying in shape and being sexy. See you guys next time.
It's RickDrayson.com. He is the equalizer, baby. See you next time.